Hi, I'm here at Cutthroat Brewing Company in Pawtucket, Connecticut, where Foxwoods has released its own brand of beer called Rainmaker Amber Ale. Let's check out how it's made. Rainmaker is an amber ale. It's uh, made with a pale malt and a certain amount of crystal malt, which gives it its uh, reddish amber color and uh, some of that deeper uh, character in the flavor, uh, as well as some Northwest uh, Pacific hops from Washington State. It's the American hop, which is distinctly American in flavor. Uh, you'll actually taste a little bit of that hop in this beer, uh, but it's well balanced between the malt and the hops. We start with malted barley. Uh, mal malted barley is uh, crushed and mixed with hot water. It's then separated from the grain. We've extracted all the sugars out of that malt. Uh, we then move it into a, a tank and boil it for 90 minutes. At that stage, we add hops, which are a flour. They're a flavoring agent, uh, essentially. Uh, the boiling helps to extract some of that flavor from the hops, as well as sterilize and uh, precipitate out some proteins. Uh, from there, we transfer, uh, or we whir whirlpool that liquid in that tank. It drops out some of the solid matter, sort of a first filtration, if you will. We pump it in uh, into the cellar, which is uh, where fermentation takes place. So we'll add yeast to the receiving tank. Uh, yeast is the agent that uh, consumes all the available sugars and creates the alcohol and carbon dioxide, which is beer. Uh, once fermentation is complete, we'll move it to conditioning. Conditioning will help uh, clarify it, uh, some flavor profile changes, we'll chill it and then filter it into a, a finishing tank and then it's ready to package. Now that was a tasty treat. Rainmaker Amber Ale, only available at Foxwoods. I'm Christopher Savoy, FNN intern.